Hello. I'm just going to make a quick comment about this article here. SNP government posts record-breaking £2 billion underspend. Now, uh, this is quite an old story, but it's still interesting. The money hasn't gone missing. There have been a lot of other funds that have gone missing. But in this case, the funds haven't gone missing. They're there. They've just not been spent. £2 billion. Now, why would the SNP governing Scotland not spend £2 billion that they've been given for various things. There was Covid funding and all the rest of it. Well, there's only one explanation that I can think of. If you can think of something else, do tell me. I think they've been starving the Scottish economy, the social services, the education, the health care, all the stuff that governments are supposed to uh, help people with. I think they've been starving them so that they can tell the Scots, well, you've every right to be discontented. The nasty Westminster government is uh, taking, is not giving us the funds we need to give you a decent life. And they're holding on to the money because that way, if they got independence, they could use that two billion. Suddenly, as soon as they got independence, the two billion would go into all sorts of stuff that people would suddenly think, oh, hallelujah, now the, uh, we're free of England. Uh, we're, we're getting our social services. Auntie Maud is, uh, is getting a varicose veins operation, you know, all, all that sort of thing. And it, it just seems to me to be a cynical uh, ploy to make the Scots suffer and then make them think that independence will stop their suffering or, if they got independence, has stopped their suffering. I think this is just just absolutely disgraceful. They have uh, people in isolated islands off the coast which don't have ferries anymore. And, and you know what? The British Army is going out there, or the Navy rather, uh, standing in for the ferries because they haven't repaired or refurbished the ferries. That's part of that two million as well. And so they take money from Britain to run their country and then, no, they take money from England to run their country and then they use British, which includes English and Welsh, taxpayers' money to pay for their boats in the Navy. It's, it's just absolutely disgraceful. And why anyone in Scotland could even think about voting for the SNP, I, I, I really don't know what's going through your mind. Anyway, yeah, that's, uh, yeah, perhaps you will write in and tell me. I'm Granny Opterix. I'm on YouTube, Rumble, Bitshoot and Minds, and I'm on Twi Twitter and Gab. That's where I let you know when I've uploaded a new video. All the links are in the description. If you think this video was worth a financial contribution, then please feel free. Links in the description. Uh, the best thing, though, that you can do for my channel is to like this video, to share this video, and to subscribe. Right. Thanks for listening. Till next time. Why not treat yourself or a favoured relative or friend to these magnificent examples of merch? The mugs and t-shirts come in the Granny Opterix design or Granbo with a firearm or the more deadly knitting needles. Go to www.grannyopteryx.com and whatever platform you're watching this on, please click like, subscribe and share, share, share.